Okay, talk to Walter Sprout. Let's do this. All right, we're here. Now, I don't know what the cellar looks like, but they'll have a security briefcase with them, larger than normal, big enough to hold the artifact. We should split up. The code phrase to identify yourself as the buyer is Ramsey and Travers. Ramsey and Travers, the scientists who discovered the neon gas. Are they? Hmm. Use the code phrase to identify the seller. Got it. Code phrases? Under different circumstances, Walter, I think you might have made an adequate smuggler. Remember, Ramsey and Travers. We'll meet back near the elevator. Locate the seller. They have a large briefcase. That's not the code. <laughs> Can you believe this place? Okay, it's clearly none of these people. <laughs> the music is amazing. Get some Aurora and let's loose. What's up? Wait, was it them? Cause like, am I just limited in to staying here, or...? Yeah? I just need a minute. I think that last drink was stronger than I thought. That's what you said two drinks ago. Maybe you should slow down. Yeah. Take it easy. Hi. I mean, you're just sitting here. Say, kid, how'd you like to hitch your wagon to a celebrity star? Hmm? That's right. The Mickey Caviar is in the market for a job, and you look like someone who could use a great ship's cook. What do you say? You sound like a serial killer. <laughs> no, I don't think so. Just my luck. I guess it's back to drowning my sorrows. I'll come back for you later, don't worry about it. Okay, here's the suitcase. Hey, Must grow. What is it? Can't you see I'm busy drinking? Oh, sure, you're definitely drinking right now. Uh, <laughs> nice pen you got there. Uh, I'm a friend named Travers. Oh, really? I heard you all have a meeting in a few minutes, don't you? In one of those fancy VIP lounges? Speaking of which, I gotta get going myself. Excuse me. Okay. Take it easy. Dr. Walter? I just saw our cellar walk by. Good job. He seems cagey to me. Angry, even. That's not surprising. This is a deal over stolen property, after all. Anything could go wrong. Now before we head in there, let me go over the ground rules. He'll ask for twice what we agreed on. That's normal. He'll probably try to walk out. That's normal, too. Don't worry about the amount we actually settle on. The Stroud Eklund Discretionary Fund is just a chip to you and me. Oh, damn. Our goal is to get him to accept that chip in exchange for the artifact. Anything goes as long as it's in our hands, and we're not dead. How does that sound? But they can die, right? What if things get messy? That's why you're here. Hopefully our combined <laughs> countenance will be enough, but grabbing the artifact and running is an option. Uh, just do me a favor and treat it as a last resort. I have a reputation. I can see that. Okay. Hold up. Let's just drink some. Didn't mean to click that. Damn it. Uh, let's just drink some wine here. If I have any. 
Ooh, five minutes only. Uh, let's go up first. Not interested. Okay, let's drink some wine. Uh, this will have to... Oh, three minutes only. Uh, we'll go for five minutes. Just because I don't know how long I'm going to take on these conversations. So you, Stroud... Oh, they're here already. You look different in person. Our public relations always insists on doing some touch-ups for the official photos. Embarrassing, really. Your security here going to stand or sit for this little meeting? Well, if you let me move. Nervous. <laughs> All sense. No sense making anyone uncomfortable. So polite. Almost makes me forget what planet I'm on. Let's sit down. <laughs> Wearing a mantis mask. <laughs> Am I to assume that briefcase has our item of interest? Yeah, here it is. Well, look at that. One of a kind, and I know you want it. I have the amount we agreed on. Uh-uh. Things have changed. I want double. Now how am I supposed to do that? I, I can't don't know, gun but your security here seems to have some fancy gear. Why don't they chip in? Be reasonable. We can't just come out with double out of nowhere. Not my problem. It is if you leave empty-handed. We came here in good faith. Now honor our previous agreement. You either figure out a way to give me what I want, or I walk out of here right now. No, you won't. You still need the money. I leave now. I can get a jump start on the people after me, instead of you all wasting my time. You'd be on your way already if you just take the money I'm offering you and shut up. What's it going to be? Take or walk? I... Ah. Uh... Hmm. I wonder if I'll get the... I'll lose the opportunity to do this. If I did. Uh, if I keep talking, but... You might have wanted more, but this is still a good deal. Fine. This yeah, so thing... Yeah, didn't even need it. It's all yours. Well done. Some high-pressure tactics, but we got what we were after. Time to go home. Shall we? Oh. Okay, let's go home. Oh, I want these. <laughs> Let's go. Stop right there. You're in possession of Slayton Aerospace property. Ah. Slayton must have been the original owner. We don't need to do this. All's fair on Neon, am I right? Hand over Mr. Slayton's property. Now. Don't do this. Don't die. Just get a rock back. It's my employer's property. That's all I need to know. You gonna make me shoot you? Give me a chance to talk to Slayton directly. We can sort this out. I'm here for the rock. I'm not your messenger service. This is not going to end well for you. <laughs> like all my persuasion checks. <laughs> I hear you. That's what I like to hear. I'm still willing to talk. There's no reason for us to have a problem, is there? I'm glad you understand the position I'm in here. Now we're getting somewhere. I'm trying to be reasonable here. Huh. 
All right. But Nicholas Slayton isn't a man you want after you. Good luck with that. Sending armed men into the Astral Lounge. Slayton must be serious about getting the artifact back. We'd better get off the planet quickly. I mean, your company's here. How far can you run? <laughs> Door. Door? Slayton wants you dead. Oh. I would hop on the first ship out of here you can find. <laughs> this door. <laughs> Slayton Get agent. out of here before more of Slayton's agents show up. All right. I heard there's shortages over at Rely Medical. Not great. Doc Manning better get his act together. Okay. Did that without any issues. That's Doc Manning. It's the worst. It's it's blowing my wrong. mind! Slayton has put a bounty on your heads. He's greased a few palms. Your ship's been impounded at the spaceport. There goes our way out. Who's this Nicholas Slayton, anyways? The CEO of Slayton Aerospace. They're a systems manufacturer. Engines. I'm thrusters. sure I can take him out. <sighs> How did they know it was us? The same way everything works on Neon. Money. It's terrible at keeping secrets. So much for this being easy, Walter. Yes, yes, I'm fully aware <laughs> this has not gone according to plan. Slayton Aerospace has offices here in the Trade Tower. If Nicholas is moving this quickly, he must be there or close by. Let's head to their lobby, shall we? See if we can make an appointment. All right. Slayton HQ, which is this way. Ugh. Okay. Just stop and restart the recording again. Oh. Ooh. Need a moment to walk that off. Yeah, it's been a few weeks since the COVID, since I got COVID, and still experiencing some of the symptoms, like the coughing symptoms. But, yeah, it's gotten a lot better now. Wait, where am I going? Uh, this way. No, that's not what I want to do. <laughs> it's late in HQ. It's this way. Oh, it's the same floor as, or same building as you guys. It's light and narrow space. Okay, they're red. I can kill them, right? Find a way to the next floor. Riley. Welcome to Slayton Aerospace. Can I help you? <laughs> Attack. <laughs> Persuade. I need to make an appointment with Nicholas Slayton. I'm afraid Mr. Slayton is a very busy man. I have an exciting business opportunity to discuss with Mr. Slayton. Hmm. Maybe I can see if he has just a moment. I won't need to take much of his time. We just had a misunderstanding. Maybe I could squeeze you in. Let me see. And there must be some way we can both win. You may think Damn it. so, but I don't. I'm afraid we just can't book any more appointments today. Goodbye. Welcome to Slayton Aerospace. I'm afraid we aren't taking appointments right Damn, now. Damn, it was going so well. I don't need to attack them. <laughs> I mean, I took what I wanted already. Uh, I don't have enough uh, digit picks. Chat with the receptionist all you want. I will cut back, buy some digit picks, and I'll be right back.
Oh, there's another receptionist now. Hoping to get a meeting? I've been waiting all day. It's ridiculous. Customer? Why are you sitting back there? I hear Slayton's had some major layoffs recently. Okay, Never whatever. Welcome to Slayton Aerospace. Executive level access. Activate. Wait. This clearly isn't your executive level. He's on to us. Walter. Uh, taking what's mine, then breaking into my office. A bold move, but one easily countered. Oh, we're trapped. Hello, Walter, dear, are you there? Issa? Took longer than I'd like, but I managed to pay off one of Slayton's security consultants. They've patched me in. All right, we've got her out. Once the door's open, just follow her instructions, okay? No, I'm an elevator person now. I build my kingdom here. Well, if my wife and I could gallantly offer your majesty a rescue from certain death, let's go. Doors will open in three, two, one. That's right. Slayton's guards and employees are all over. Be careful. Okay. You'll want to use the vent system to slip around unnoticed. There's a cover just to the right of the elevator you came in on. All right. Still hidden, apparently. I don't know how. Can we eavesdrop? That's the elevator you came in on. Jump right across the top of it and keep going to the end. Drop down and follow the conduit all the way to the end, past the fork. Follow all the way to the end. Wrong side. Follow the conduit. <laughs> okay. Hmm. There's a vent above you. Just climb up. Okay. We're not being extremely sneaky here. Running all the over the place. Below you is clear. Drop down. Ugh. See no grub. Disgusting. Oh, I can't shoot it. Ugh. Oh, those sounds. Ugh. Stop. One of the doors leads you right into the open. I'm unlocking a safe route. Opening the door on your right. Go now. Where's Walter? Where's Andresia? <laughs> left, but don't go through the door at the end yet. There's a robot stalking the hole. Wait. It's walking down the hall. Go down to your horse to the door. How are you here? Security is on full alert. No points for the target now. I can't and shoot. Hold on, oh, no, try to shut down that robot. Got it. I can't shoot for some reason. They're scrambling the protocols. I doubt that'll work again. Uh, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to reload this. I thought I couldn't shoot the worm, but I guess I just can't shoot in general. <laughs> okay, let's try to do that again stealthily this time. Doors will open in three, two, one. Yep, still can't shoot. Guards and employees are all over. Be careful. Okay. You'll want to use the vent system to slip I mean, I didn't really do anything wrong that There's time, but we'll just like speed run this. You came in on. That's the elevator you came in on. Jump right across the top of it and keep going to the end. Uh. Drop down and follow the conduit all the way to the end, past the fork. There's a vent above you. Just climb up. The room below you is clear. Drop down. Yep. Still can't shoot. Stop. One of the doors leads you right into the open. I'm unlocking a safe route. Opening the door on your right. Go now. Head left, but don't go through the door at the end yet. There's a robot stalking the hall. Wait. It's walking down the hall. Go now, to your horse, to the door. Keep 
going all the way to the end. <laughs> Screams. What was that noise? I can't do this. Hey, false alarm, everyone. I'm going to save it. <clears throat> and then Wait, there's people in the room up ahead. Closing the shutters. I may have to like reload to an earlier spot if this d still doesn't work. Cuz I can't shoot anything ahead. right now. Wait for it to pass, then head straight across to the maintenance door next to the security gate. Go now. Security I'm is on full alert. No Bullshit. Yeah, I... I don't want to, like, keep loading this, but... I can't shoot right now. <laughs> so, we're gonna have to sneak through this. No matter what. Wait, there's people in the room up ahead. Closing the shutters. Yep, still can't shoot. Another robot Which weapons ahead. didn't work. Wait for it to pass, then head straight across to the maintenance door next to the security. Security is on full alert. Oh, bullshit. No point slipping on this now. Let's just see where that is. Take you outside. Okay. There we go. <laughs> Not the most uh, stealthy, but we made it out. Yes. Well, I guess after you. They're just gonna leave us now. <laughs> yep. Still can't shoot. Okay. What's going on here? Uh, I'll go talk to... What's the next part of this quest? Climb the trade tower. Over there. I would love to shoot all of you, but I can't. Oh, I think my game crashed. Oh my god. Uh, no it didn't. Did it mess up my bindings for some reason? No, it's still fine. I'm gonna stop the recording right now, see if I can investigate a little bit. Okay, I did some googling and I figured out how to solve this issue. Uh, I'm gonna try to see if I can find a way to do it right now. Actually. Okay, so I had, had to do some googling. Apparently the way we solve this issue is to go into a uh, character customization menu. You can do that at the doctors, but I'm nowhere close to one apparently. So let's just see if I can do that and then I hope this doesn't break my achievements or anything and then finish uh, Calvin oh and then save changes no now I should be able to shoot yeah that's a weird bug. You die today. Whee. So let's go back here. And then Let's do some fighting. Good one. Okay.
get some of that XP. Always worth checking. Sure. I don't know what you might find in their pockets. Mm, let's just climb this tower. To Should be a little bit easier now. Are you Wait, actually. Uh, this way? Ooh, what's that? <laughs> Bad aim. Whatever. How do I get up there? There we go. I should reload. <laughs> I wonder if we could have done this without alerting them, like, at all. Nice. Picking that up. Credits. Uh, whatever. I'll pick the ammo up too. Air Slayton Aerospace. Let's go. Confront Nicholas Slayton. You know, it's moments like this that really makes Neon the best place to I do agree. business. I agree, you're about to die. You steal what's mine. I trap you in the city. You infiltrate my office. I lock it down. Where else can you match wits for the highest stakes but here? <laughs> Call off the guards, Slayton, and release my ship. You have what's mine. I, indirectly, have what's yours. We are at a... Ah, uh, no, we're not. I'm the main character here. Although, I do count a few more guns on my side. Fine, what's a few more bodies? I don't want to talk with this guy. Ah, <laughs> uh, hmm. What will happen to our relationship with this aerospace company? Uh, let's see. I won't trust your mercs, they haven't stopped us so far. Hmm. You do make a bold point, but that doesn't resolve our current dilemma. If it's still... Perhaps I can help. We're both people of business, Nicholas. In the same industry, no less. Yes, I'm beginning to see the opportunity. There is, however, one final detail to disclose. Mr. Musgrove, my former employee, and the thief responsible for our serendipitous meeting, was caught prior to your arrival. I think it would cement our new partnership if you were to decide on his sentence yourselves. Decide as in we could let him go. If you wish. You will have the opportunity to tell him yourself, shortly. It seems reasonable that a thief face some form of punishment, does it not? My security brought Musgrove to my office. I'm sure seeing you again will be a fine conclusion to your previous business. We have an opportunity to spare a man's life. I know he probably wouldn't do the same for us, but that shouldn't matter. Hmm. I believe Mr. Slayton asked you to do something. Yeah, I don't care. I'm coming up here. Get out now. What are you gonna do? 
This place ain't for the likes of you. What's in there anyways? Ah, uh, you got one chance to back off. I can come back later. <laughs> now. Oh, damn. Oh, no. You. Slayton really does have a sick sense of humor. He wants me to decide what to do with you. Please. I was just trying to sell a product, okay? Isn't that why we're all here? Be lenient. We were taking advantage of his initiative, after all, even if we have found ourselves working with the man he stole from. Uh, we're letting Gyo get out of Neon while he can. I... Thank He's you. gonna die. Use this opportunity to alter the trajectory of your life. What the you hell? You may not receive <laughs> another chance. <laughs> She's still in that room. A moment of compassion for this city. Very well. I'll clear things up with the authorities. Can I still shoot You're you? You're free to go. Time to go. Let's talk more back at the ship. Don't worry. You'll never see me again. I mean, look at all that blood. You're dead. Of course I'm never seeing you again. <laughs> well, it's not stealing. I think you may be trying to take a little too much on. This was a good Literally. Very productive. Uh, I won't say no to free stuff. Contraband cash. Just saying straight to it, aren't what you? What is it? Uh, let's trade. Need to see what I'm carrying? You need to carry my stuff. That is all. Very well. Okay. Uh, I am hidden. Okay. Let's see what we have here. Seems to be the only one, and then we need that, and then that won't work, that won't work, this one will work. The one, two, three. This one, this one. Well, technically, as long as I don't leave with these here, I could sell these, right? Sentient AI adapters. Okay. Let's go. Huh. Is there anything in here? Uh, there was something else in here, too. Med packs. Uh, okay, it's the stolen stuff. We'll come back for this stuff later, when we don't have contraband on here. Slayton sure takes his security seriously. I don't know whether to feel safe or nervous. Uh, okay. <laughs> Get going. Mr. Slayton is done with you. Everyone's on like high alert here. Your company send you out here too. I don't see the point of face-to-face -face meetings with component vendors. To be glad I'm not the only one waiting around in this lobby. She's the only one that's like normal right now. We're only taking meetings with our preferred clients at the moment. 
Okay, let's go. Wait, where are we? What are we doing now? <laughs> okay, let's get back to the ship. I'll probably cut to when I get there. Devin and Nastis has run into some trouble. Oh, actually, never mind. I'll try to sell the contraband first. I'm sure there's a trade authority here. <laughs> trade authority. Yeah, what? Yeah, what? I'm here to sell you contraband. Hello. Yeah. Buying, selling, or moving. I'm not sure how to answer that. Yeah? Well, then let me spell it out for you. You either walked into the TA to buy some goods, sell some goods, or have some liberated goods taken off your hands for a reasonable price. So, instead of wasting my time making me explain how the business world works, let's get a move on. Liberated goods is a, my specific area of interest. Now that's what I'm talking about. We both want to make some money, so what'll it be? Uh, let's just Been do some here, business. I thought you were just wasting my time. <laughs> yeah, well, we'll sell the contraband that we just got. I don't know if selling it to specific people would, like, make it better, but... Sort by value. Oh, yeah. Um. Yeah, we'll just sell all this stuff here. Uh, I'm keeping the Heart of Mars. <laughs> and in terms of weapons, nothing I really want. Misclick there. Um, eight. And some med packs. And resources. Aid. Ammo. I need some of that. Ah, that's about it. All right, buzz off. I'm busy. <laughs> Yeah, we'll go back to the ship. I will go into orbit first, just to see if there's any, like, people shooting at us, but... I'm guessing we're gonna go back to... Constellation, or the Lodge. Now that we have a moment, I wanted to ask uh, how you're feeling. After your experience at the okay. temple, you've given everyone at the Lodge quite a scare. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Let me just, like see you first before I talk. Oh. Captain, do you recall <laughs> She's down here. <laughs> okay. Um. Let's go in. Hopefully she goes inside. Any what? adventure you can fly away from. Why is she even here? Is, is that She's not mean? assigned to my ship. Okay, this is ridiculous. Okay. We're going back to our ship. <laughs> and we're blasting our way out of here. Us dead. I guess we can call that a win. What do you think?
You're going to recite that Sebastian Banks speech later. After this? With enough Chandra Vineyard's Merlot in me, I just might. I admire your restraint in not having done it already. Oh no! A great success. Thank you for allowing me to tag along with Constellation's newest star. <laughs> yes, I used a pun. Forgive me. <laughs> Fiscal quarter added. 10,000 credits. Uh, Fiscal quarter. Ooh. Security guard uniform. This looks badass. Um... Oh, <laughs> I thought that was like a note or something. Okay. Uh, let's take off. Identify yourselves. The fact that you do not know says much. We are the Starborn, and you are unworthy to possess the artifacts. I do not recall that we asked your permission. Tell us, please. What are the artifacts? What are they for? Did you make them? What gives you more right to them than humanity? Answering your questions is exactly what we cannot allow. Abandon your thirst for knowledge, or drown in it. Call yourselves whatever you want. You're just thieves to me. A sentiment that is shared by my kind about you. <laughs> We're not the ones making threats. Your moral grandstanding is hollow. As is your position. Make up your mind, or we will act. I'm not liking what I'm seeing on the scans. The energy output from that ship is far above the normal range. If we spin up the grav drive now, we have a chance. Hmm. I'm not great at space combat. Full evasive maneuvers. Let's get out of here. We'll get through this. Hold on. So where are we going? <laughs> Grab jump to anywhere. Uh. Let's. Go back to Constellation and not here. Or else. I could probably take it, in, right? Damn it! Now I kind of want to find out. <laughs> well, I don't know about you, but I've never You're heard of the United stop. Colonies space. Maintain course of prepared It's an overdrive. We need to regroup at the I'm launch complete. immediately. Enjoy Tell Noel to analyze the data off the ship's sensors. <laughs> Everyone's going to want to weigh in on this. Agreed, we should not delay. Hmm. Okay. Let's go back to the lodge. Will we be stopping for food? I would yeah, it was kind of a shame. I, something because of the 
My ability to shoot, I kind of missed out on some of the XP of like, killing everyone there, but... <laughs> I am glad Whatever. to be back. It will be good to have a moment to relax. Okay. Is everyone here? Apparently not. Sarah's obviously not here again. Because, again, she doesn't give a damn. Let's see if we can find her. Oh my god. Sarah, you suck. <laughs> Okay. Well, let's talk to everyone. Uh, talk to Noel. Get out of the way. Okay. How is Neon? Are you? Are you okay? Uh, we were attacked. We need to hold an emergency meeting. Wait, what happened? Who was after you? Take a look at the ship's sensor data. I think everybody needs to see this. Except. Uh, all right, I'll start transferring the data over. Except now. Sarah, apparently, she doesn't care. Let me just bring <laughs> it up on here at the table. Where the hell is Sarah? <laughs> okay, there she is. <laughs> is that? Is that a prototype? No, that material isn't anything. They don't either. care either, apparently. <laughs> what the? Everyone, come take a look at this. That's no faction vessel or Crimson Fleet. Secret military tech, maybe? Hmm, no United Colonies Admiral approved that starship design. They call themselves the Star demanded we hand over the artifact like we were children playing with their parents things what do people know any offshoot groups go by that name not in any corner of the settled systems i've oh, seen everyone's here didn't Maybe even notice them the colony finally popping its head up uh, another house for room i very much doubt that we ignoring the obvious here a heretofore unknown group who just happens to know about the artifacts. I'm just gonna say it. Intelligent alien life, or extra-dimensional beings. The original creators from the furthest fringes of space. Or beyond even that, is the metaphor of avenging angels coming down to keep humanity from forbidden knowledge not apt here? So, we have a lot of theories, but nothing concrete. Except that they're after the artifacts. And they're willing to take them by force. To Barrett's point, the artifacts clearly, clearly aren't human made. No settled systems lab made these things. And I doubt one of them made that ship either. So we got some weird extra dimensional beings that coincidentally decide to build their spacefaring vessels exactly like we do. I'm not so sure about that. Noel. Start analyzing all the data from the ship sensors. The gravitational wave they caused, scans of their weapons, shields, everything. We're in the dark. We need to learn anything about them we can, including some way to fight them if necessary. Until then, we stay the course, collect the artifacts. It's even more important now that an intelligence we don't know or understand is looking for them. Everyone should get ready for a fight then. I doubt they'd stop. All we can do is be more cautious, but we are not stopping. This could end up being a race we don't want to lose. Vladimir, has the eye picked up anything new? Some glints of shine in the dark. Ready to hand them out as soon as you please. All right. Good luck, everyone. And be careful out there. And then we'll add to that artifact to the collection, and then uh, uh, we'll end it there. I'd appreciate a chat. So no one cares about this. I know now isn't the best time, but I need to talk with you later. So many things going on. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, pardon me. 
<laughs> was that your stomach or mine? Okay, so they don't care about the artifacts anymore, yes. apparently. Okay, as so... As much as I love uncovering new questions, I wouldn't mind a few answers now and then. Okay, so I'll end the video here. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye. Hey, future Calvin here. I actually went back to a previous save to fight this guy, simply because I needed to take some screenshots for the thumbnail anyways. I'm not going to show the entire video because it was just me trying to get into a good position to take a good picture, but this nerdborn was a giant pushover. He basically doesn't give you anything, um, no loot, no XP, and he basically just runs away in the end. But you, but I've never heard of these starborn. We prepared the crash right. Part of my brain is an overdrive. You need to regroup at the lodge immediately.